a heap of rice in the form of core of diameter 12 meters and height is 8 meters. How much canvas cloth is required to cover the heap? A heap of rice in the form of cone of diameter, diameter means from here to here, 12 meters. The radius is how much? Six. Six. Because 12 by 2. The diameter of a cone is 12 meters and radius of the cone is equal to diameter by 2 that is equal to 12 by 2 that is equal to 6, six meters. And the height is uh, 8 meters. 8 meters. That's clear. Here we here we have to find the cloth required to cover this one. That means we have to find the covered surface area of the core. That is help to cover the heat by the help of core. Isn't it done? Here we have pi R L is a formula to find curved surface area of core. Here we need L to find the curved surface area of core. I have a relation between slant height, this is L slant height, this is the height and this is the radius. L square is equal to R square plus H square because this is in the form of some right angle triangle. Therefore, hypotenuse square is equal to sum of the squares of the other two sides. That means the slant height whole square is always equal to height of the cone whole square plus radius of the cone whole square. It is clear. Therefore, first we need to find L to find curved surface area of the cone. So L square is equal to R square plus H square. Therefore, L square is equal to R square means uh, radius is 6, 6 square plus height 8 square. So L square is equal to 36 plus 64. L square is equal to 100. L is equal to square root of 100. Then L is equal to 10. 10 times are 100. 10 is the square root of 100. That's clear. Now we are going to find curved surface area of cone that helps to cover the heap of rice. Right? Therefore, curved surface area of core is equal to pi r l. Here we, I need to take pi is 3.14. We are given hint that pi is 3.14. So 3.14 into my radius is how much? 6. And my slant height is how much? 10. 10, Ten into 3.14 31.4. Do you know this one? 10 is multiplied by 3.14 gives 31.4. Into how much you have to multiply? 6. 6 4 jar 24. 6 1 jar 6 plus 2 8. 6 3 jar 18. That means 1, 188.4 square meters of cloth required to cover the heat. That's clear.